ladies and gentlemen, the next president of the United States of America, Barack Obama, 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 President, he's the next new president, he is Senator from... Welcome to your favorite English program on RTU2. We today are at the embassy of the United States of America to share with you the American dream. A dream based on hope. To start, let's follow. Yes, we can by Will I Am. It was a creed written into the founding documents that declared the destiny of a nation. Yes, we can. It was whispered by slaves and abolitionists as they blazed the trail towards freedom. Yes, we can. Yes, we can. It was so. It was thought by immigrants as they struck out to the western shore of the Pine Ridge. It was whispered by the general of the Pacific Oh, yes, we can. It was the call of workers organized. Suggest that we are one people, that we are one nation. 
We hope you were delighted to listen to this song. I hope you were, Jay-Z. Yes, not now, because it was inspired by Barack Obama's mm -hmm. remarks after he won the presidential primary in South Carolina. Mm. Okay, now we invite you to listen to the translation into French, a text full of hope and passion. Yes, we can. The justice and yes, equality. We can. Translation. Yes, we can. It was a creed written into the founding documents that declared the destiny of a nation. Yes, we can. C'était un credo inscrit dans les documents authentiques qui définissait la destinée d'une nation. Oui, nous pouvons. It was whispered by slaves and abolitionists. It was sung by immigrants and pioneers. Yes, we can. Il fut prononcé par les esclaves et les partisans de l'abolition de l'esclavage. Ce credo fut également prononcé par les immigrants et les pionniers qui ont bâti les États-Unis d'Amérique. Oui, nous pouvons. It was the call of workers who organized, women who reached for the ballots, a president who chose the moon as our new frontier. C'était le cri de guerre des travailleurs réunis au sein d'une organisation syndicale. Le cri de guerre des femmes qui ont obtenu le droit de vote. Ce credo était aussi le symbole d'un président qui a choisi d'étendre jusqu'à la lune les frontières des États-Unis d'Amérique. Yes, we can to justice and equality. Yes, we can to opportunity and prosperity. Yes, we can heal this nation. Yes, we can repair this world. Yes, we can. Oui, nous pouvons établir l'égalité et la justice. Oui, nous avons le droit aux opportunités de réussite et à la prospérité. Oui, nous pouvons sauver cette nation. Oui, nous pouvons redresser ce monde. Oui, nous pouvons. We've been warned against offering the people of this nation false hope. But in the unlikely story that is America, there has never been anything false about hope. On nous avait dit de cesser de donner un faux espoir au peuple américain. Mais dans cette Amérique, fruit d'une histoire particulière, il n'y a jamais eu quelque chose basé sur l'espoir qui ne s'est réalisé. We are one people, we are one nation, and together we will begin the next great chapter in the American story, with three words that will ring from coast to coast, from sea to shining sea. Yes, we can. Nous sommes un seul peuple. Nous appartenons tous à la même nation. Et ensemble, nous écrirons les merveilleux prochains chapitres de l'histoire des États-Unis d'Amérique avec trois mots qui retentiront du nord au sud, de l'est à l'ouest. Oui, nous pouvons. Will I am produce this song to share his inspiration and invite people to reunite. Let us also mention that this speech made him think of Martin Luther King, John F. Kennedy, and people who died for the freedom of the United States of America. Let's now learn the words used in the lyrics. Words and expressions. It was a creed written into the founding documents. A creed. Un credo. Principes sur lesquels on fonde son opinion, sa conduite. Creed. Se dit aussi en anglais. Credo. Le pluriel est. Credos. Exemple. Never say die is my creed. Ne jamais désespérer est mon credo. Two. It was the call of a president who chose the moon as our new frontier, the moon. La lune. 
a new frontier. Une nouvelle frontière. The moon as a new frontier of the United States of America means La lune comme une nouvelle frontière des États-Unis d'Amérique signifie Since Monday, July 21st, 1969, the flag of the United States of America stands on the moon. Le drapeau des États-Unis d'Amérique est sur la lune depuis le lundi 21 juillet 1969. 3. We will begin the next great chapter in the American story with three words that will ring from coast to coast, from sea to shining sea, from coast to coast. De la côte nord à la côte sud. From sea to shining sea. De l'océan Atlantique situé à l'est des États-Unis d'Amérique à l'océan Pacifique situé à l'ouest des États-Unis d'Amérique. The sea. La mer. The seaside. La plage. The seashore. La bordure de mer. Women's Right for Your Ballot had been a very important event in the United States of America. You're right, JC. This voting right was obtained in August 26, 1920. Okay, in the following rubric, we're going to learn words related to the ballot. Communication, election. Le 44e président des États-Unis d'Amérique, Barack Obama, nous informe dans son discours que le credo du peuple américain était aussi le cri de guerre des femmes qui ont obtenu le droit de vote. It was the call of women who reached for the ballot. Comment. Dans ce cours, nous allons étudier le vocabulaire relatif aux élections. A vote. Un vote. The ballot. Un vote secret. The ballot paper. Le bulletin de vote. The ballot box. Une urne. To cast one's ballot. Voter. Déposer son bulletin de vote. First ballot. Premier tour. Second ballot. Deuxième tour. A polling station. Un bureau de vote. A polling day. Jour du vote. To go to the polls. Aller voter. To poll votes. Obtenir des voix. Voters, electors. Électeurs. Constituency, borrowed. Circonscription. Constituents. Électeurs du circonscription. The electoral register. La liste électorale. Election campaign. Campagne électorale. To tally the votes. Décompter les voix. Situation. Quelques phrases avec les expressions étudiées. Le pays organise une élection générale. The country holds a general election. La campagne a débuté il y a une semaine. The campaign started a week ago. La liste électorale, les bulletins de vote et les urnes sont déjà dans les bureaux de vote. The electoral register, the ballot papers and the ballot boxes are already in the polling station. All right, this is the end of today's English program. As the saying goes, where there's a will, there's a way. Be hopeful and never say die. And don't forget, practice makes perfect. See you next Saturday at 6.45 p.m. Bye, Dana. Bye, Jay-Z. See you. Hello, world. This is me. Life should be.